Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. We have a really good time doing the recreating Instagram videos, so today we're gonna take it a step further, a little more iconic, and do recreating TikTokers Instagram. Erin picked three photos of different TikTokers, and I picked three different photos of different TikTokers. We don't know what each other picked or anything. This was a little bit of a challenge. I had to literally Google top TikTokers, because I know like, Three, and I wound up going with like the big ones. It was really hard with TikTokers because a lot of them are like group photos. So finding ones that I was able to work with were a little bit challenging. Okay, let's get started. First one that I chose was Dixie D'Amelio. This is my first picture. I figured it was gonna be kind of easy to remake. Start off a little easy. You just need like a darker room and take a picture like against a wall and then like make sure it's dark and just do black and white. I feel like for this Dixie one, I can literally just wear like anything because it's only going to be my head. <laughs> but you won't even see what I'm wearing. So I'm just wearing like this right now. So I'll just wear that for the picture. I figured for this one, I would shoot it in the dark. We could literally probably just do it right here and just turn the flash on so that the back is dark. I literally have no idea how lighting works. So <laughs> we'll see. Okay, the first photo I chose is of Avani, and it is this photo. I think it's really cute. I have, I know I have a black top that looks pretty much exactly like that from the photo. I have to like figure out the rest of the outfit, but I think I can do it. There's that top, I, oops, there's the tag. Here's the top, I feel like that works like perfectly. And then I also found these gray sweats that I think I'll just cut. I feel like this will work, even though it's not black, but it has like the same vibe, you know? <laughs> I feel like this is gonna be pretty close. I have a couple pair of scissors, but these hair scissors literally work better than my other one. So I'm gonna try to use these. I hope they work, but I don't know, we'll see. Look how easy that cuts, what the heck? I genuinely can't believe how nice this is cutting <laughs> when you simp over scissors. Okay, I'm gonna put the outfit on and then add the accessories and put my hair up and everything. Okay, we're definitely getting there. Let me get some jewelry really quick and we'll find some socks and shoes. I think this looks good, looks pretty similar. Put my hair back. Okay, I found these glasses. These are from the Can France box that we talked about one time. And we're gonna go take a photo. I think maybe in front of like a garage or something. I don't know, we need to find something with like the same type of background. We're gonna do this little door right here. I feel so weird, it's like so not my style. <laughs> yeah. she, I feel like I look weird, but she pulls it off really good. She's really cute. Just not my vibe, you know? Cool. Cute. Cute. Oh my god. I think it's really good for what I had. Yeah. That looks really good. Next one I chose was Miss Addison Ray. I chose this one specifically because we have the same flower bush in the front yard. So I was like, oh, perfect. And I have a white button up that will like kind of work for this, I think. So hopefully that works. I'm so excited because this is the first sunny day all week long. I've been trying to do this, but it's been raining. Classic New England weather. The last time we did one of these videos, it was also raining for days on end. So I'm happy I'm gonna finally be able to get this one done. And this one, all you can literally see on Addison is her wearing the white shirt. Hers is more like a sheer fabric. I have this like classic white button up. I think that'll be perfect. That's like literally all that is to this photo. So I'm just gonna roll up the sleeves. All of these flowers have like fallen down. <laughs> Oh no, they used to be high, so I'll probably just have to get like very low to the ground. There's also so many bees. Oh, sad. Gonna do my best here. Well, the second one, I'm doing none other than Queen Charlie D'Amelio. Cutest girl of all time. Kind of cute one that I can just do like on my balcony maybe. I honestly can't tell for sure is white or blue, but we're gonna go with white because I don't have a light blue shirt like that but I do have a black dress I can mimic. I can use a good old candy t-shirt. Then I have this black dress. It's quite different, but I think it'll do. Okay, so here's the outfit. I feel like obviously it looks very similar. I guess I'll just put my hair up, like the little top half pigtail thingy. And then I also realized that she has her front little bangs braided that are not in the pigtails, so I'll do that too. Okay. <laughs> Charlie did it a lot better, but you know what? It's all right. It's not like they keep like perfect, but like whatever. Sorry, it's so loud. Living in LA, it's just people constantly blowing their leaves around. Other way. Oh no, I did the wrong hair then. <laughs> Is this looking good? Yeah. Normal? You yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. Other way. There you go. There you go. There you go. Don't move. Don't move. Oh yeah, that's cute. 
guys, we want to thank the sponsor of today's video, Casetify. Just know that we love Casetify so much. We've been using their products for years and promoting them for years. We really, truly stand. Not only are the phone cases stylish and cute, but they have military grade drop protection so you can feel comfortable dropping the case from six feet knowing that it is protected. You can choose from thousands of designs or you can customize your own case with your own font and color selection. Also, they've done so many collabs with so many cool people. I love Casetify cases so much. One of my favorite things about them is how sleek they are. They aren't super bulky, which I love, so I can just like put it in my pocket and not feel weird or put them in like small bags and stuff. The customization is literally my favorite part of Casetify. You can put your name anywhere, different colors. You can get a little parking pass on your case. <laughs> you can make it reflective. I mean, it's all cute. Go to casetify.com slash Carlene and you'll get 20% off and you can match with us. By the way, if you buy a USPS case, a percentage will go towards the USPS. And look how cute they are. Last one I chose is this. It is somebody, it is somebody named, oh my God, please don't drag me. It is a girl named Avani. I don't know her. I'm, I'm not gonna pretend like I know her. I don't know her, but she's so cute. I was going through her Instagram. I love her. She's so cute. I figured I'm near a body of water so I can do like a beach shot and I have like a white cardigan like that. I have a black tank top. The only thing I don't have is like heart pants and this specific bucket hat, but I do have a bucket hat and just a pair of jeans. I can like try to make it work. I have already started packing to go home, so like everything that I need for this is in my luggage. So bear with me here. I packed all of my summer things already, and then I was like, oh, let's do this for a video. I guess I'll just wear this one. That's like kind of the same as that. It's on a triangle top, so it'll look a little different, but that's okay. And then I need a pair of my Levi's. I'm gonna get my like highest rise ones that kind of look like the pants that she's wearing. Where are you? This is like the same color as the heart ones. So I'll wear this, this, and then this cardigan. I don't have a beige bucket hat. However, I do have this black middle kid one. So I figured that's like the closest thing. And then she's wearing a few necklaces. I don't have any silver jewelry with me. So I'll wear like the closest thing that I do have. Then we're gonna drive on over to the beach down the street. We just got to Grey Gables Beach. It's unfortunately not windy. My hair will just not look like it's blowing in the wind and I'm okay with that. Here is what I'm wearing. I like layered the necklaces as you can see that like she kind of had. I'll probably turn this around so like Chris here's your promo right now middle kid go get it. Oh no, I wore my crocs that are fluffy. They're gonna get all sandy This is my third one <laughs> It's just kind of funny because it's definitely more of like Instagram modely looking and I'm definitely not that but I think it'll be funny I really don't know how she got her hair like that. I couldn't tell you what she used but I do have a wand So I'm gonna try my hardest to use a wand and maybe get my hair like that I feel like it's not gonna look the same though, but you know, I can try my hardest I also have a bright neon green like workout outfit. I feel like I can just wear that. Okay, let's try to curl this hair <laughs> It's like pretty tight curls too. But I just like not do the back because I'm not even filming the back. <gasps> Okay, well, this will be good when I brush it out, I think. You know what, we're not gonna worry about it. I'm gonna keep doing my hair and then I will turn this back on once I'm done and I'll brush it out and see if it looks somewhat similar. Done with my whole head. Low key, this is a cute curl. Kinda giving me like Taylor Swift debut album vibes. Mm -hmm. Don't know if it's like exactly like hers. Let me look again, but I feel like it's not too far off. Uh, it's kind of far off. <laughs> Hers is also like, she had it professionally done, I feel like, or it's a wig, I don't really know. Literally look like I'm about to sing our song um, at a karaoke bar. Let me put on this like neon outfit. I'll show you what it looks like. Here's the outfit. I want to show you who it is. Oh, we could do that. So easy. In the little... You're like, please not in public. <laughs> no, I was saying we could do it in the little... Yeah, we do it in the bathroom. Yeah. That's where we can know. We can no, do yeah, it let's do it. yeah, let's do it in the little walkway. Because it has walkway. all the... Yeah, all the yeah. All right, TikTok star, how did it go? It went pretty good, um, pretty easy. The last one took a little bit more work. Ooh. If you can um, tell by my hair, it's uh, you know not how it normally oh, is. I did notice, I was like, oh, that's interesting. I've never seen her, her hair like that before. <laughs> Are you Lauren Gray? <laughs> no, no, <laughs> but I did look at hers. Yeah, the one that I thought was going to be the easiest, which is the first one, actually wound up being the hardest and it's terrible. Oh, really? Wait, I want to see. <laughs> it was Dixie D'Amelio. Okay. This is what it was. I genuinely was like, oh, this one will be easy. And then my dumb ass forgot. I have no idea how lighting works. And it, it looks so bad. 
<laughs> Mine looks so bad. Oh my god. I mean, yeah, I would look at this and be like, uh, how? I was like, oh, it's black and white, it'll be easy. Yeah. And like, I'll start off easy. But then I was like, I don't know how to make the background dark like that. And oh my god, I, oh my god, it's terrible. <laughs> now it's gonna live on the internet forever. Oh my <laughs> okay, well, I don't think it's actually a bad picture. Your teeth just look a little funny because of the lighting, I think. I mean, it looks really similar. I would give you credit for that. I don't think it looks that different. I mean, obviously it's not as dark, but. Yeah, I just think, um, <laughs> not for me. <laughs> Wait, where did you take this picture at? In the basement, because I needed it to be dark. <laughs> You kind of look like you're trapped in a basement, so I guess that really I makes was. Sense. Okay, I'll send you my first one. Let oh. me guess who it is. <laughs> Let me guess who the TikToker is. <laughs> well, the picture I have has her Instagram in it. I don't know if you know her or not. I don't know her. I'm, I'm not gonna pretend like I know her. I don't know her. Oh, I did one of hers too. You did? Wait, I have like literally the exact same pair of shorts as her. They're like Brandy Melville pants that I just cut <laughs> off. Oh, I had to cut sweats too for it. But oh, you cut clothes? Okay, and then here's my final product. Yeah. Oh, that's good. This is perfect. Yeah, I really liked it. I thought it was Avani, cute. Avani, come through. The next one I did was Addison Ray. A bad leap. I called yeah, I called Kourtney Kardashian to see if she could fly out here to pose in one of the pictures, but unfortunately she was busy today, so... Oh, how annoying. Uh, so this, like, beautiful photo of her. I already I can, like, really... feel the shirt that you're gonna be wearing, I feel like. I had a little bit of trouble with this one, too, because the sun kept going down as I was taking this one, so it kept going behind <laughs> clouds, and I needed the sun. Oh, yeah. But then when the sun came out, I literally couldn't open my fucking eyes. <laughs> Oh my god, that's so cute. I like how you kind of match like the flowers in the back too. Yeah, well when I saw the picture, I was like, oh, we have a bush just like that. I feel like that's a photo you would post. I don't think I would post no? this. It's if it really looked pretty. more like Addison's, I would. <laughs> <laughs> the next one I did was Charlie D'Amelio, obviously. Oh my god, what did you do? That's so funny. I looked at this and I was like, I sort of have a dress like that, but I have <laughs> no surroundings like that. I guess oh. my surrounding wasn't super similar. Actually, it kind of is. I'll be the judge of that. Oh god. I'm scared. <laughs> oh my god, I can't believe we're the D'Amelio sisters. We each picked one. I know. Yeah, the background is just a little different, but I, yeah, but I think it's good because like the door in this st in stuff. Oh my god, cute. I think my favorite is the last one though. Mine is also the last one. Who did you do? Avani. Oh my god, that is so cute. Very cute, right? It's so 90s. I love it. And then this one's mine. I tried. <laughs> We're just not as cool as the teens. <laughs> oh, cute. Oh, oh my, I mean, it's perfect that you're by the water too, obviously. And you got the like exact necklaces. Yeah, they're a little different, but yes. And then I was like, I have a bucket hat, I have blue jeans, and I have a white sweater, so. I don't know if you know Daniel Cohen. I don't know how to say it. It's like Daniel Cohen or Cohen. Wait, is it Daniel or Danielle? Danielle, I don't know. Was I saying Daniel? It sounded like you said Daniel. Oh, I, yeah, I don't Daniel know. Daniel Cohen. Wow, I mean, to see this outfit. I'm like, you have something like this? Sort of. <laughs> You'll know as soon as you see it. Okay, here's my photo. That's why my hair is like this. It definitely does not look like hers, but I tried. Well, it's not coming through. I'm oh. so impatient. <laughs> I just want to see what outfit you I have know. on. Oh. <laughs> Oh my god. Good old Fabulous. That is so <laughs> funny. That is so funny. Oh, cute. Funny. I'm so sad my Harley. hair doesn't look like that. That was everything. I wish I could. I don't know how she did that. Is that wavy or like what? Probably used one of the um, wands. That's what I used. Well, you guys, comment below who else's Instagrams you would like us to make copy to <laughs> recreate. To recreate. Yeah. Any other like groups of people or, you know, presidential candidates. <laughs> I don't know. Thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure to like and subscribe and we'll, we'll see, see you, you on, on Sunday. Sunday. Bye. Bye.